Hey, this is Lorette from The Learning Tube, and this is this week's quick tip. Now, what I want to show you in this week's tip is the Chrome Web Store. It is awesome. So, but warning, it can be addictive. There's so many cool apps that are in here. So if you use a Chrome browser, which a lot of people do, and I like it, the Chrome browser, you can go to the Chrome Web Store and download different apps to help you. So first of all, when you go to the Chrome Web Store, this is what it looks like. These are the featured apps right here. And then you can go by different categories and you can go by features right here. For example, if it runs offline, there's one really good one that called Gmail Offline. So if you use Gmail and you don't have an internet connection, but you have a lot of emails that you want to respond to. So for example, I use this when I'm on the airplane. So I will use Google Gmail Offline and I will be on my laptop answering all these emails and then when I get online, they send. So that's an app that's in here, it's Gmail Offline. And you can click that and it filters all the different apps that can be used offline. You can hear features by Google, free ones, Android, all these different ones. And then you can sort here by category as well. For example, if you are looking for some tools that can help you with uh, productivity. I love productivity related stuff. I can click productivity and here's Google Translate. So if you need some translations, you can use this. Um, here's LastPass. We actually did a quick tip on LastPass. I love LastPass. It's a great password management tool. And then here's some other cool ones here. Here's Chrome Cleaner. Here's blocking ads. See all these things can help you with um, productivity. So all of these cool ones. Remember I told you though, it can get addictive. There's so many different things that you can download and add to your Chrome browser. So that's productivity. Here's another one. Let's see. Let's go to blogging. Let's see what we got there for blogging. These give you screenshots. So if you want to add your screen captures for web pages, that's a great one. Google Voice, I love Google Voice. It allows you to make calls um, from your computer. So that's a good one. Here's, I don't know this one, Amazon Associates. Here's Add This. All these different ones that can help you um, with different, let's see. Here's a shorten, I think, key points in our remove ads. So shortens ads things here. Um, but these are for helping you if you do blogging. Here, let's see some other ones. Um, let's see. News and weather, photos, search tools, shopping, social, sports. What's accessibility? Let's check out what that is. So this has different, uh, so different themes. This is something for YouTube. I don't really, tab resizer. So just different things here. It's kind of neat. Let's see. What are some things by Google? These are ones by Google itself, which I always usually love Google, Google related things. But here's like a bookmark manager, your calendar, Google image search, Google analytics, Google voice. So all the Google stuff that you can add right here. Here, we can go right here now to apps, and here's more. Here's the featured in the front. So basically, the Google Chrome Store is a great way to get different apps and different tools that can help you with, uh, with your business, with your productivity, with even not your business, your personal life. It can help you with to-do lists and different things. Uh, here we have Team Viewer. So if you want to uh, get remote support on your computer, you can have Excel online here. You can become a DJ. So all these different fun apps that you can use. And this is the Chrome Web Store. Have fun.